The role of Daenerys Targaryen in the acclaimed fantasy saga made the British actress a global star. However, this petite brunette with the appearance of a teenage girl, above all, the actress theatre, and in Los Angeles from his native London, she went from his native London just then to conquer the theatrical scaffolding, In the series was caught by chance, in Los Angeles. Amelia settled in the oldest non-profit Hollywood theater called Company of Angels, but she didn't make much money there. At first, she barely made ends meet. To pay the rent, worked at different jobs, starring in serials and passable movies, and dreamed of the role of her life, and soon got such a role. Late at night in her apartment rang a bell. HBO Channel was going to screen the novels of American science fiction writer George Martin. Agents were looking for a girl for the role of the daughter of the king, of the Seven Kingdoms Daenerys Targaryen. The casting was set for this morning. Amelia had no idea who Daenerys was, but she went online, poured over Wikipedia and realized that her heroine would be the central character in the upcoming series. Such a chance to miss cannot miss, thought Clark and early in the morning hurried to the casting. However, the producers were looking for a completely different type. They needed a tall thin blonde with a swarthy skin color. Amelia was a chubby petite brunette with a cute expression, but the girl so heartfelt read a couple of monologues of his heroine that casting managers were conquered by her expression. Amelia was approved for the role and especially for her costumers made seven white wigs. Two months later began shooting the first season. In Ash White Wig Amelia Clark looked just great, and the directors and producers and viewers were enchanted by her selfless acting. On the set of Amelia had an understudy, however, she refused her services, and all explicit scenes were filmed independently then incurred the wrath of the guardians of morality and feminists. After the success of the pilot series, Amelia immediately signed a contract for the next seasons. However, physical and nervous overload on the set for the actress did not pass without a trace. At the end of work on the first season, the young girl had a stroke, yes, and with complications, needed surgery. Amelia was very afraid that she would no longer be able to act in the movie. Fortunately, health quickly recovered. The actress began to be invited to other projects. Amelia Clark even played Sarah Connor in the fifth part of Terminator, and the cyborg from the future, played by Arnold Schwarzenegger, became for her pops. Old, but useful. Since then, Amelia regularly appears in big movies and boldly experiments with her role, preferring dramatic projects. She finally settled in Los Angeles. In 2016, she bought a large house. Everything is going great for her, despite the star status. Outwardly, Amelia is still the same teenage girl with a naive smile on a cute face.